Good morning, everyone. This is Rafe Gal. We are playing Blaster Master Zero. Uh, sorry, Blaster Master Zero. Two. Unfortunately, we took a hit there, which really hurts, but I think we should be okay. I'm really mad at myself for losing uh, gun power off that fight. These That guy's normally not super hard. So yeah, we're on Sector G, which is uh, apparently boss rush land. And we've refought one boss so far. We're gonna most likely... Or so we fought all the, or refought all the pink bosses first. Now we're refighting, I'm assuming, all of the... Uh, Jason fights. That's right, they give like a ton of grenade drops. actually really unfortunate. That was a slightly different end, I think, but that's okay. Um, okay, now I'm curious. Can we walk all the way back out and refill health? Looks like we can refill or er, walk back out and refill gun power. That was the problem I was running into. Nope. Okay. I'm guessing we'd have to exit the map and possibly refight the bosses if we did that then. I guess we're continuing. Likely one more. And honestly, most of these weren't too bad.
Pretty sure this is just over. We were a little aggressive with our grenades there, but we really sunlocked him hard. So I think I'm okay with that. Safe point, good. <laughs> Oh, this guy again. Okay, so this guy, I s oh, never mind. Yeah, I mean, yes, this guy again. You must be tired of fighting the endless hordes of mutants, right, hero? Why do you keep getting in our way? The mere sight of you disgusts me, the way you live so carefree and how everything goes your way. The way you foolishly dote upon that broken doll at Flatpool. I couldn't do anything for my planet or her. Why? Why is it that you can't? Planet G. That's the name of the mutant overlord that completely destroyed the place I called home. You will inevitably face Planet G if you stay on this path. However, you don't stand a chance. It's pointless to tell you now, right before you die. But I won't be satisfied to just let you be killed by that monster. I won't let it take anything else. I'll take it myself. Gee. Okay. This guy is just randomly evil. Great. Again, back to the good character development here. Attacker. I need to be slightly better about using my And I need to actually use the dash here Then I think I should be okay Good news is I've managed to keep my Good news is I've managed to keep my gun power. The bad news is that I've taken about half my health doing it, regardless. Guess I'm no match for a hero. Going to show mercy again? That's exactly what I'll tell you something interesting. The dimensional tunnel to Sophia is already under Plan AG's control. You'll inevitably face Plan AG if you stay on this path. If you face it in battle, the worst will come to pass. We have no chance of defeating it. Okay. Why are we. The worst will come to pass. Planet. Question, 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 map. So we get the rest of the map. Plenty there to this area. We didn't have to refight the uh, the other boss yet. The dimensional guy that we fought last time. Okay. So I'm assuming that our... Buddy Leibniz is, uh... This planet is... Is this planet G? Did the entire planet turn into a mutant? The signal from the tunnel is coming from inside it. It swallowed the tunnel to Sophia. Okay, so we... Oh, 
We'll find a way. Okay, so this entire planet is the boss. We are literally the parasitic Death Star Pan Palais G. Or Planet G. Okay. I have no idea what to expect here. some point here. I'm not sure if we're supposed to be targeting it or just targeting the monsters. charge energy by landing hard, and in this case, what we need to do is just land hard to damage him, also. Okay, so now it's going to start cycling in between hits to protect itself. Basically one hit per cycle now. Make sure we actually land a hit before it cycles again. hits him. like we just need to get the highest point on our jump to actually hit it now. What? It's 
health is like refilling as we go now. Brain thing apparently is a health restore or a health drain. So we need to make sure we're off the ground for that. regular cycles? Its health got so high again that we just needed to do a regular attack, or er, the regular cycles for it again? it. Okay. This fight should have been over a long time ago at this point. This last phase is just dumb. I think I need to stop doing the stupid drill when I do that. Well, this is dumb. <laughs> okay. The concept is cool. The Getting those last couple of hits in when it keeps healing itself is very challenging. 
I suppose the good news is, now that I know how to actually fight it, I can probably hit it a lot harder. So I think I misread one thing, which was that you needed to get super high jumps for the end. God. <laughs> like, we're getting it down. We're getting the pattern down a little bit better. I just don't have a good way to predict that little blood attack. And we're missing attack cycles sometimes because there's no good indicator. The background keeps moving. I was thinking that you could, like, read the situation based on the background, but no. The background... 
continue scrolling even though the planet stopped. So let's do first things first. Just grind out as much damage as we can as fast as we can. Get some early health. This last cycle is really the only one that's been problematic. I'm guessing we're about ready to be on it. So apparently, the trick to this is stop playing so defensively. I think the Gaia system could be used to defuse the planet G's energy. No signs of dimensional explosion. Planet G, it's collapsing. We did it. No, it can't be. The signal. The dimensional tunnel planet G swallowed is becoming unstable. We won't make it in time. Just as Leibniz says, the worst has come to pass. Thanks to Jason, we avoided the super-dimensional explosion. I don't think Leibniz could have known it would turn out like this. We successfully defended, defended Planet G, but when Jason finally destroyed it, the dimensional tunnel inside went wild. It swallowed it, turned into a black hole and swallowed us up. Jason, Fred, G. Sophia, and me... We've all been separated. Jason never gave up. He always forged ahead, facing every danger. But if this is the result, what did we even accomplish? It seems this journey was a reckless gambit from the start. What else were we... What is it we were missing? Memories of the MA pilots and support droids float through my head. Their bonds took on various forms, all different from Jason's and mine. I don't want to think the meeting of... That meeting them was a waste of time. If I could do it all over again, I'd learn more about them. Even the bonds between us. And then maybe, just maybe, I'd find that something we lack. That's just the feeling I get. But even if I'm full of regret, I can't change the past. Without G. Sophia's energy, it won't be much longer now. Bad ending? The... Uh, communication? Mutants attack, we, your support. G. Sophia, please respond. Repel, this is Earth. That was all for nothing in the end. He couldn't save his partner, and now his home planet is doomed, just like me. Maniacal laughter. Well then. I just want to see what happens when I load this up. Okay. So it puts you back on the outside of Planet G. So, it looks like my complaint about... or my consistent complaint about this game, which has been that uh, it feels like the side characters, support characters are really shallow and need more development, 
may actually be being addressed. Let's see if I look like a complete asshole by the end of this. <laughs> Uh, so I think the plan is gonna be... Obviously, so that was a bad end. So I think the trick is gonna be we need to go back to each of the previous planets that had a partner on it. I'm guessing we're going to have one additional side quest with each of them, or something along those lines. And then I have to go back to the final boss with, you know, full party unlocked. So... I think we're gonna wrap this video here. That was, uh, that was pretty crazy. That boss fight was weird. Um, and let's see what we can figure out for next time. Hopefully you're still enjoying. If you are, please give me a like and subscribe. Check out the other content on my channel. If you have any questions or suggestions, please leave them in the comments. And as always, have a good one.